from the teacherportal.ca. Here's a video on a product called EasyBib. As you can see, uh, EasyBib is a cloud app. Uh, right now I'm running it for, through my browser. It is uh, free. Uh, there is an upgrade. The free version includes uh, MLA style. So if you're looking for something different, uh, it will, um, you'd have to pay. It also serves as a, a great tool to research and uh, organize notes, uh, organize uh, elements in paragraphs, all done virtually and very simple to use. Uh, that's available for about $165 a year. If I wanted to uh, search a book, this is a great tool. Uh, students basically go to the link, they type their book. Um, I don't know, let's go with uh, a Wealthy Barber. for an economics class, several of the books will show up that have been published by this uh, title. So you can scroll down several books. If you know you have the latest edition, uh, you basically can select it and it will come up uh, with all the details. It gives you the uh, publisher, the city, the year. Click create citation, done. Um, at the bottom, what will happen is all the books that have been added by you are available. As you can see, I added a newspaper article, which was very simple. Um, as you can see up here, there are several tabs. So one, two, three, four, five. The main ones are available here. So books, newspaper, I added the newspaper article, added all the content in. And what's even more interesting is all the different types of uh, new age uh, sources to cite, which a lot of students often struggle with, including teachers also struggle with this. So a blog, film, online video, uh, maps, uh, paintings, how to do any basic type of citation, it's available. One click, there it is. When you're done, you scroll down. Let's assume I wanted only 